a retired high school English teacher says a letter she received from President Trump would have barely earned passing marks, so she corrected the letter and sent it back to the White House. Ivan Mason an Atlanta resident who retired last year after teaching middle and high school students in South Carolina for 17 years, corrected grammatical mistakes in the letter bearing Trump's signature, including 11 instances of improper capitalization of words like president and state. If it had been written in middle school, I'd give it a C or C+, Mason told South Carolina's Greenville News. If it had been written in high school, I'd give it a D. She did not attach a letter grade to the letter she sent back to the White House. Mason acknowledges the letter was likely written by a staffer. She received it after penning a letter requesting that Trump meet individually with the families who lost loved ones in the February 14 high school shooting in Parkland, Florida. When you get letters from the highest level of government, you expect them to be at least mechanically correct, she told the newspaper. It's stylistically appalling, she added, comparing Trump's writing to the exquisite letter she's received from South Carolina Sen. Lindsey Graham's, our, office. The teacher said the White House response did not address her request specifically. Trump previously held a listening session with Parkland community members and the victim's parents to discuss the prevention of school shootings and gun violence.